the No Fate Channel, checking in. And on this episode of Dad's Bucket List, I am finally getting out of my comfort zone and teaching myself a new video editing software, DaVinci Resolve. A few years ago, I started this No Fate 24-7 YouTube channel because I wanted to learn how to edit videos. I knew I would never take the time to teach myself if I wasn't fully invested in the outcome. Before I built this monster computer, I had an eight-year-old HP that was substantially underpowered for the majority of video editing programs out there. There were a number of great programs that were free that I wanted to use, I wanted to learn, but just simply would not run on my computer because of the processor and the graphics card. I finally settled on Lightworks. It was the most sophisticated program that I could actually get to run, and oftentimes it would actually crash on me. Um, the learning curve was steep, it stunk. My first two minute video that I ever edited took me three hours just to figure out how to do it and how to export it. It was, it was brutal, and I still remember uh, the time that I invested and how frustrated I got. I finally got comfortable with Lightworks. My speed of editing improved. I learned a few extra tricks in Lightworks that helped improve the quality of the videos and uh, audio as well, um, at least compared to the, the first few eyesores that I released. And um, honestly, I got too comfortable. I forgot all about um, the other excellent programs that had better free version than Lightworks that I originally wanted to tackle but didn't have the processing power to do so. A few months back in a previous Dad's Bucket List video, I built this eight core behemoth of a computer using mostly used computer parts from Amazon, eBay, and Facebook Marketplace. Uh, even though this monster could handle all of the programs that I originally wanted to learn for video editing, I was nervous and afraid to step out of my comfort zone because I knew the time investment was gonna be substantial just to get back to where I already was with Lightworks. Well, two weekends ago, I went down to Danielsville, Connecticut to see the Bleecker Street Rippers play live at Harmonies and Hops. And it was a great time, but I knew heading home that the amount of footage I got and the sound quality because of the rain and background noise was gonna take a substantial amount of editing. And that's when I decided to draw a line in the sand that I was gonna use that video as my uh, benchmark, as my, as my starting point for a new um, video program. So I downloaded DaVinci Resolve and started editing. And it took me forever. It took me over a week of editing that video to finally get it out, to get it to a satisfactory state that I was willing to upload it on YouTube. The time investment really hurt and was super frustrating relearning things in DaVinci Resolve that I already knew how to do in Lightworks. It easily took me 10 times longer to edit in DaVinci Resolve than it would have if I had just used Lightworks. But now that I've gotten that video out, and if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out, I'm able to export in not only 720, but 1080p, um, so a much better quality of exporting. And there's a number of new free features that DaVinci Resolve has that Lightworks just simply didn't without having to pay for the full version. Even though it cost me a number of extra editing hours and a wicked amount of frustration, with the release of the Harmonies and Hops video, I have now climbed the biggest mountain in DaVinci Resolve. With the time as I edit more and more videos in DaVinci Resolve, the speed at which I edit those videos through the use of hotkeys and repetition, as well as the quality of the videos that I release now that I can edit in 1080p, as well as learning new editing techniques for improvement should go a long way to improving the quality of this channel. I got out of my comfort zone to conquer this bucket list item, and now I'm moving on to the next. If you're far too comfortable sitting on the beach, it is time for you to get up, dive into that cold ocean, and tackle your next bucket list goal. If you've come this far in the video, then definitely give it a like and hit that subscribe button. There are a lot of new bucket list, dates with dad, community cultivation, and dad's diet videos headed your way that you do not want to miss. As usual, thanks for watching and don't save anything for the trip back. The No Fate channel is dedicated to providing you with ideas on how to improve your community. Your community at home, your community in your neighborhood, and your community in your town. I'll also be giving you insight into this dad's 
tricks, trips, and tribulations. <laughs>